The longest serving member of the state Senate now faces charges for filing false campaign reports. Fletcher Hartzell from Concord turned himself into the Wake County Magistrate Office today. CBS North Carolina Steve Sprager joins us now from the Wake County Justice Center to give us a better idea on the charges. Steve. Well, that indictment became public early this afternoon here at the Wake County Justice Center. By that time, the senator had already surrendered himself to a magistrate. It's a two-page indictment charging the senator knowingly filed false campaign reports between 2010 and 2013. The Wake County DA says it took several years to wade through all the documents after investigators from the State Board of Elections forwarded the results of their probe to her office. Specifically, the indictment obtained by CBS North Carolina says the senator falsely reported multiple expenditures from the defendant's campaign account, when in fact these payments ultimately benefited the defendant financially and included expenditures for the upkeep and maintenance of real property owned by the defendant. Monies actually uh, were used for to upkeep property that he and his wife maintain, um, that to use pay off credit cards, uh, including American Express, uh, and then also some money being paid to his law firm um, for other expenditures that personally benefited him. Those are the allegations in the indictment. The Wake County DA also tells me that the probe by her office is not the only one. She says there's also an ongoing federal probe. We reached out to the senator's lawyers seeking some sort of comment, but at this point, he has not been able to get back to us. Reporting live, I'm Steve Sprazier, CBS, North Carolina.